What's going on guys, LCG here, and I'm doing a collaboration today with Saved Game Channel. I think it's more like they're doing a collaboration with us. Uh, how you doing this morning, man? Doing great, how are you? Hey, another day in paradise, right? <laughs> so we yes. both decided to step out of our mold a little bit, and uh, you know, we, were, we were perusing Reddit, if you will, and we came across a discussion about MUDs. Multi-user dungeons, and you'll see on the screen here. Uh, I think Save Game Channel have that up as well. We are we're going to be playing a text-based game, and we chose Bat Mud because they actually just hit Steam Greenlight on the fourth of November, I believe. Is that accurate? Yeah, I think that's what I said. Yeah. So this is this is kind of a new realm for both Steam and uh save game channel and myself both so what we're gonna do is we're gonna run you through the character creation process and we're gonna go ahead and dive straight in how's that sound you like that that's that great plan? cool take uh, it away all right so we got to start with a character name i i i hate these uh <laughs> i'm always struggling on what to do so i'm actually i'm just gonna do save game channel because i'm or save game cha <laughs> <laughs> there is a character limit um, because that way maybe it won't be taken. That's the worst when you spend like 20 minutes coming up with a name and then it's like, oh, I'm sorry, that was taken. Oh, yeah. Or you're uh, you're going to get in game and they're going to be like, oh, but you're not mythological enough. Oh, you're right. You're right. Okay. Maybe I need to. Yeah, it does say. Uh, well, well, what's a good mythological name? And I don't know. What is the. um. What is the well, it looks theme like their, of this one? I, I don't know. Um, it looks like their policy is just outright silly or offensive. Oh, okay. Well, save game channel. Then. Yeah, I think you'll be <laughs> fine, man. I'll do Lima Cha just to piggyback off that. Sounds good. All right. I'm seeing a, uh, a background window yes. here now are you seeing the same thing i do a background defines the influence under which you've grown up and Ooh. what you will learn in your first 10 levels it can be changed later through reincarnation oh interesting all right that uh that seems very very typical of your rpg style stuff uh, yeah. what, what direction do you like to lead in these games Ooh, evil religious that sounds awesome Evil, Evil is always, always present, present in the realms. Nice. All right. Hmm. So you're going to go one of the... Is that... Are they spellcasters or... Uh, maybe. It doesn't... It, it does say evil religious cause harm, both physical and magical. So maybe it's, uh, it's a magical also uh, with melee abilities. Yeah, that's kind of weird. Yeah. All right. Sounds cool, though. <laughs> All right. So that's what I am. How about you? What'd you think? What do you think? Hey, I'm, you know what? I'm going to go good religious. Oh, you know, no. You and No, we're going to fight shoulder to shoulder. <laughs> Evil and good fighting together. That's right. We're going to come back to neutral today. All right. <laughs> that sounds good. Oh, my goodness. Look at these races. You can be a duck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be an evil religious duck. Ooh. I think that's perfect. Um, I, I'm, I'm a little uh, on the edge here. The uh, the thricken, thrick, thrickrin. Ooh, what is that? It's a uh, grasshopper. Oh, okay. Well, that's actually xed out for me, so I can't be that. Mm. Um. So I'm definitely gonna be a duck. You should definitely be a cricket, because. You know, normally good versus evil, duck versus cricket, you know, yeah, but listen, but we're going to come together. <laughs> it's not a cricket. It's oh, a I'm sorry. Grasshopper. A grasshopper. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> All right. So they ask for your email here real quick, as well as a country of origin. All right. We'll put in. Oh, I just skipped straight through the alignment portion there. I'm sorry about that. I only had one option, which was evil. <laughs> yeah, I was in the same boat, except good. 
Gotcha. All right, congratulations. Beautiful. I already have the back client. Do you? I do. I actually have it open right now. So I All right, so I'll switch, switch over. Switch over. Bump. All and right. It looks like we can log in. Ah. Uh... So, okay, I'm in, I think. Yes, I'm in. Let me Is there any way so for those of you who are uh, who are interested in this, this is going to be a learning experience together, right? Uh, Save Game and I, we we have zero experience with this game, completely blind. Um, but I do have a confession to make, man. Are you ready? <laughs> okay. All right, lean in a little bit. Yeah. Closer. Yeah. A little bit closer. What is it? All right. Mm -hmm. So I've actually made muds before. Get out. <laughs> I have. Don't don't hold it against me though. That's pretty cool. Alright. Uh I used to be a well I'm still a programmer in my free time, what little time uh -huh. that is. But so I'm familiar with the baseline of how these operate. Okay. Well I've got a I've got a secret. Uh what I used to play Mume all the time. Oh no. <laughs> So we're all right. We're in good company, at least. We're in good company. Yeah. yeah. Right. Now that was years ago, and I barely remember it. But, but that, yeah, that that was the way I wild away the hours as a teenager. Okay. So this this is not completely foreign. No. To either of us. Good. Now, I would really like to be able to make this text significantly larger. <laughs> Just because, um, you know, you can't read this on, on other people's screens, I don't think. Mm-hmm. So, all right. So, have you, all right, what are you looking at right now? If you were to type look, what do you all see? Right. <laughs> you have completed the creation of your character in Batma. That is not final. You can reincarnate. That's a lot of instructions. Yep. All you the... receive a weapon, some armor, a newbie crystal, and some miscellaneous items. You wield a steel scimitar in your right hand. You wear a steel oyorio. Yeah, that's um, that's actually a type of cookie here in the United States. Um, I don't know why they made it out of steel, though. That's silly. <laughs> Oreo. <laughs> nice. <laughs> It's spelled O dash Y O R O I. Yeah, yeah, I got the same thing here. Um, oh, really? Okay. And then there's a newbie channel window. Do you see that as well? I do. All right. So uh, they introduced me before they introduced you. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say that you're the newbie here. <laughs> Sounds good. You are more new than I am. So that's right. <clears throat> Excuse me there. Okay, so I type look again to get the beginning. Yep. Uh, do you... you are at... Oh, look at that. I can see you. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yes. There you are. You wield a steel scimitar in your right hand. Start of the path through the woods. This is where it all begins. The great adventure known as Batmud. To end this tutorial, type tutorial end... Throughout this tutorial, check the command tutorial, blah, blah, blah. All right, well, I'm going to go through and read tutorial 100 real quick. Um, <laughs> okay, no, I'm not. That's a lot. I'm going to skim tutorial 100. Um, <laughs> you think you remember? So it looks like we're in the world of, or the land of Lanor, mm -hmm. one of the continents of that world. But my memory is a little shot right now, okay? Okay. Uh, I wonder if we can. You're dis you already took off. I did. I ran away from you. I went south. The typical evil. <laughs> we go our own way. Just doing whatever they want, completely abandoning all these other get things that are going on. <laughs> all right. Did you want to try to party up right now, or do you want to just kind of oh, get through sure. the tutorials? Um. 
Well, you know, it might be helpful to go through the tutorial and get an idea of all the commands and everything. They're probably the same as every other MUD, but uh, the tutorial instructed me to go south. So, yeah. You are walking on a path in the woods. Here you learn the basics of looting, a very important skill. Yes. To get something, you type get something. For example, get ring. Ooh. Oh, how convenient. There is a ring lying right here on the path. I don't know about that. It may be a trap. It may be a trap. I took the thick electrum ring. Thief. I'm calling you out in front of everybody. <laughs> oh, I am evil. I mean... <laughs> yeah. Alright. And then we see that we can wear it. Ah, uh, well. yes, indeed. And then... Now, View your equipment, inventory, or head south. Let's see what's to the south a little bit. Okay. Head south. New tutorial page found. This is where they actually tell us we wear rings, but we wield a weapon. Aha. Uh -huh. All right. When you've worn the ring, continue southeast, or SE, for short. Here we go. We're seeing Bandits. a clear night oh, sky. Crap. Okay. All right. I guess well, I'm what gonna are we going to do first? Do you see me fighting him? Uh, not really. Okay. Well, this is uh, it's showing rounds on my screen. Round one, round two, round three. Okay. Um, and then in the top right-hand corner, I didn't notice this before, but I actually have like a little avatar. Do you have that? I do, yeah. Okay. So it's got the health points, I'm assuming spell points and energy points. Yeah, yeah. All right, cool. So this is a, this is a big step up over uh, the Telnet that I'm used to using. Definitely. Back once upon a time ago. Yeah, I like this addition. It, it helps, helps keep track of your character a lot better. Yeah, that's neat. And I'm glad that they're, uh, they're trying to pump this into Steam. Did you kill your bandit yet? I did. It took four rounds. It took me 14. Whoa. I guess being evil has its advantages. <laughs> yeah. I'd say right. so. Holy smokes. <laughs> I had a spell. Now, can you cast spells? Uh, did you have to do it on purpose? No, I just, I ran uh, Kill Bandit, and then it did it automatically. And it showed the skill uh, and the spell monitor charging up. And then he cast the spell, and the guy died pretty soon after that. Okay, so no. Um, no, I don't think I did cast any spells. But if I type the word spells, I have cure light wounds, cure serious wounds, and celestial spark. So maybe I need to use those on my own. Oh, maybe, maybe. I have um, Cause Light Wounds and Shocking Grasp. That shocking Grasp. Ugh, and shudders down my spine. It looks like it's pretty powerful. It has a 60% next to it. I don't know if that's the damage it does or if that's the possibility of it hitting. or. Yeah, I don't know either. We'll find out. We got time. All right. So I head southwest. Southwest. I am following. Oh... Lead on, Grasshopper. <laughs> this. Some of the... Ooh, one more command. Finger. It shows some info on other players. You can try it. Just finger really Lina bad. Cha. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna... <laughs> I, I try to keep me... my channel G-rated, but this game... <laughs> good lord. Going around fingering people. All right. All right. So I guess I'm gonna finger myself. <laughs> and... I'm a level one mortal of the Thrickrin race. Uh, shows how old my character is, whether or not I'm idle. Ah. And uh, what else I have killed. And I have no plan, apparently. Yeah, mine says the same. He has no plan. <laughs> Just withering away. All right, now, how do you then. spell your character? Uh, L-I-M-A-C-H-A. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Okay, I just fingered you. <laughs> and how 
how'd that work out for you? <laughs> Pretty good. I got all the info on you. No, give it back. He has killed a bandit, robbing the passersby. Uh, 116 EXP. I got more EXP than you. That's weird. Probably, you probably use spells. Whoa. I got 129 for the kill. You got 116. It's probably because you're, you're, I would guess your combat took longer, more rounds. Maybe you get less EXP. I don't know. Maybe. I was thinking because you use spells, you might get Okay, yeah. Maybe. But yeah, you had 129 experience. Okay. All so, right. Shall we continue south? Yeah, let's do it.